Oh yeah, baby, we did it! Oh man, two Alpha Raptors and an Alpha T-Rex on this leveling session. That's so unbelievably cool. Apprentice. It is your friendly neighborhood Slipgator here, hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Playing some Mark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved server. Hope you guys are having a good day. I am having a great day. Last night and this morning, I've done a ton of work on the base. I'm going to tell you all about all the stuff and things that we did. But before we start that, thanks so much for coming to hang out with me today, guys. I really appreciate it. And thanks for you guys showing your continued support in all the series. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. If you like this video, smash that thumbs up button, peeps. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. So I set up the industrial cooker right there. I got a little bit of irrigation here. I'm gonna go ahead and get that extended out. We're gonna change some stuff back here. I decided to put it in the back. I've gone ahead and changed over all of the wood ceilings uh, on the floor and the ceiling. If you're gonna be a wood ceiling, be a ceiling on the floor and a ceiling on the ceiling, all right? I mean, I'm not a ceiling all just, but I'm just saying. So that's all switched over. Everything's good to go there. I set up over here last night the industrial cooker, a little storage bin for stuff and things. And then I started making a bunch of jerky. I made some cooked meat jerky, and then I have made some prime meat jerky as well. So we've got a bunch of this stuff going on. Because today, I feel like we did so much. I'm so sick of building right now. We've done a ton of building, and it's great. We need to do more, and that's fine. But today is not a building day. Today is doing the other stuff and things day. Today is a taming day. And I want to try to find a high-level Argent today. So that's what we're going to work on. So now that we have our industrial cooker... We have all the stuff and things that we need. Well, I had to borrow some citronol from Whippet's farm um, that he has because I don't have that set up yet. We'll get it set up. But everything else inside of here, we're good to go with. We got the mayho berries. We got the water. We got the fiber. We got the stego eggs for stego kibble. It should be good to go. Oh, I think we might have to put something in here. But there we go. It should be making them now. Let's see here. Is it going to go ahead and make the second one? Are you going to do it? Can you do it? I believe in you, thing. I believe in you! So I've heard that you need to put a water jar in here now as a catalyst to get this thing to work because there's something buggy about it and it actually looks like that that's the case. Let's see if we stick this water jar in here. Now it seems to be working perfectly. Yeah, look at that. What the crap? We're gonna have to make another water jar now or we can just pull our other one out. So there we go. We got five. This thing is so fast. I love the industrial cooker. That's why we're just moving straight from regular stuff to super industrial stuff. So we can get super industrial speed. Super industrial speed and hot super industrial action. So, all right. Now we've got 11. Bam. There it is. Nailed it. A stick can't be stopped. We can take this back. We'll take this back. We'll take this back. We'll take this back. We have one of those guys. So we will squirt... This in here, this in... We might need more refrigerators. This in here, we have plenty of room now, but I foresee us having issues in the future. So, all right. Now, do we have enough gas inside of there? We're doing good. We're doing good. All right, so I got 100 darts. I've got the kibble now. Let's go ahead and squirt that onto here. We've got a bunch of narcotics, more than enough to get any sort of an RG tame done. And we're on our way, peeps. We're on our way to do some taming today. I hope that this works out. How's Statler? These guys are doing great. Everything's going great. All right. So we're going to head over to the charred island over here, whatever you want to call it, the new Carno Island, and take a look and see what we can get done. Oh, also, before we do, while well, I can talk to you about it right when we're going over there, you know, one of the things I'm really interested in getting it is a, is a higher level, and we're really not, uh, uh, wait, what? Oh, this is wrong. <laughs> Derp. Let me go ahead and show you here. We're still really far from like 82 or whatever. We're probably going to have to go out and do some alpha hunting but um i did some research on the industrial forge and it's five and a half blocks high and our base is not five and a half blocks high so i have an idea we're gonna have to go ahead and do a little bit of new building stuff but again i want to take a little bit of a break from building at least for today to go ahead and take a look at this so all right here we are we're ready to rock oh man this is uh, i can't see a thing because the stupid quetzal head all right let's turn around backwards and let's see what we got over here can't see. Quetzal. Okay. we've got, There's got to be a way we can do this. I think if we turn around all the way. Let's get a little bit closer. Look at all the RGs. There has to be a good one in here somewhere. Let's slow down. Now we should be able to see. Perfect. What? We can't see a thing. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> there's a 70. There's a 70. Are these both 70? 70 into 50. That's a 121 female Rex. 
Oh, that guy's down. It's all over for you. This actually might be kind of hard. There's a one. There's a 145. Is that a 145 RG? No, that's a 145 Carno, I think. That's a pretty high level Carno, but we're we gotta look for RGs. I can't tell. They're all dying. There's just no way. I don't know on this island how, if you found an RG, a high level one, how you could like peel it. You know what I mean? Like there's so many high level guys here. Maybe we'll just find a solo one somewhere. That would probably work out best. Might as well try to get some hot experience action while we're looking around here. Oh, look at that white T-Rex. You want some of this, stupid? Take this. One of these. One of those. And one of these. And we have no melee damage. So this is terrible. Okay, finally. What level are you, super amazing T-Rex? 65! And then, see, this is what I'm talking about. If we were, were to find a really good RG, how the crap would we separate it from the group there? I don't know. We'll have to figure it out. We'll have to cross that road when we come to it. Plus, we have, like, no damage. This this might be a challenge. Well, I'm up for a challenge. I like a challenge. You want some of this? You want some of this? All right, we got the two. Oh, the two right there. Okay. Oh, oh, it's a 145 male RG. Oh, baby. Okay. Okay. Uh, You know what? Argent would be better for this. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in deep trouble disaster. What is it? Oh, you stupid saber tooth jerk. Okay, I got that saber. Let's just have a quick look over here. 75, 85. No, we want to get this guy. So if I had my Argent, I'd be able to come in here and just kind of like grab these guys out of there. But I don't know. This is not going to work. This is really bad. I can't. Um, I could shoot him. Look at all this big disaster. I think we're going to lose it. I think we're going to lose this guy. Let's get our gun out. We just poop our pants a little bit. Re what? Reload your gun? This is taking forever. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. It's over. You know what? This is not going to work. We are going to have to get our RG. We're just going to kill this guy and get his XP because he's going to die anyway. So the best way that we would have been able to do that instead of having the quets would be to do to use our RG to go in and grab guys out. I think that's going to be our best bet. So I'm going to kill these guys. I'm going to go get uh, Midas and then we're going to come back and we'll be ready to rock. And we're back. I've been looking around for a super RG, but I got to tell you guys something. I'm running out of weight because I've been throwing basically everything away on Midas. But I got a bunch of stuff on here now. I killed a Alpha Raptor. Um, I got a primitive uh, hide hat. But look at this. I got a bunch of eggs. There's just so many scorpions and RGs on this island. I've been getting a ton of eggs from this. I haven't seen a 150 yet. Oh, what? You're kidding me. Oh, 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 oh. Quick, 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 quick. We got to get him over here. Oh, do we miss? We got to get him over here. Come here, come here, come here. Why are you not upset? Okay, this way. Yes. Yes, this, this way. Okay. This is going to be bad, maybe. We've got to run towards his feet. Okay. Run towards his feet. Don't hit me. Oh, ow, 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 ow. As long as we circle around like this, he shouldn't be able to hit us. Oh, he's already getting sleepy. He's already about halfway torpored out. That's why he's running away. Up there would be a great spot. If he went down up there, that would be perfect. Oh, I think. Where is he going? What is he doing? What are you doing, stupid guy? Is he attacking something up here? No, he's just having brain worms. Why do you have brain worms? Come here. He's got brain worms. It's totally fine if you have brain worms as long as you do my bidding. Oh, oh, ow, ow, ow. Okay, run at his feet. Run at his feet. He's down, he's down, he's down. I can't believe what we did it. Guys, I've been out here. I can't believe it. I was just about to head back to base because I had all those eggs. But, uh, yeah, no. We're good to go. We got a perfect team RG. Or we will, I do believe. Oh, and I went back to base earlier. And um, for a second, I did go back there. Um, and um, I found three more Stego eggs. So we made, And I made three more kibble. That's why I have some more kibble inside of here now. So, um, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm so excited. Oh, oh gosh. Midas, are you so excited? <laughs> I'm really excited. Okay. So we're going to sit around. We're going to guard the body. 
We have to make sure nothing aggressive comes up here. What a perfect place. This island has so many aggressive dinos. This is such a great place. Look, there's a couple of saber tooth right near here. I'll go and take those guys out. This is a pretty safe spot, to be honest with you. I'm pretty excited about this. So, oh my gosh. Where did that dark saber go? There's one right here. We're going to go ahead and take this guy out. Oh, wait. I missed him. So, all right, guys. We're going to go ahead and make sure the area is safe. We will keep an eye on our new RG. We got to think of a name. And then we'll be our bees, peeps. And we're back. And in just a few moments, our new 150 perfect tame RG is going to be arisening, rising, waking up, and becoming tamed. Plus 74 levels. That means he will be 224. I can't even believe it. This is going to be so amazing. And he's a male, which always oh, up. Oh, we have to name him something amazing. We have to name him something. We have to resurrect the old name. No. Of the super powerful RG from seasons past, Foulmouth, level 224. Let's check out his statistics. 2,920 health, 2,400 stamina, almost as much stamina as health. 500 weight, 475.5 melee damage, 100% movement speed. Nailed it, aced it, can't be stopped. Foulmouth is back, peeps. I'm so excited. Oh, baby. We've got to head back to base, and we have got to... Oh, wait, 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 wait. The... Oh, wait, 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 before we do that. We got to land again, actually. We have to pull that kibble off. He's going to eat it all. I forgot about that. Let's bring him down over here. Come here, buddy. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Hope you didn't eat too much, stupid fat guy. All right, here we go. Okay, we got it. Oh, bam. So 14, and he used eight. So that was six. So we can actually, if we were to happen to find another one, we could perfect tame another 150 right now. And we need one. We need another lady so that we can breed them. I can't wait. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we've got to head back to base, and we've got to get some hot level action on this new Super RG. And we're back at base. All right, so we have some stuff and things we've got to drop off here. We've got to drop these eggs off. We've already got six Scorpion Kibble now and seven RG Kibble. That's super awesome. I'm going to hold the rest of this kibble on me. We have some items we've got to drop off here. Let's squirt those inside of there. We've got a huge amount of chitin. Uh, we're going to need some of that to craft up our saddle. What else are we going to need for our saddle? Let's take a look here and see. For RG saddle, I think it's, yeah, hide and fiber, which we, have, oh, <laughs> which we have tons of. So let's go ahead and grab that. We will go ahead and grab this. And let's go ahead and craft up our RG saddle. All right, sweet. So we're good to go with that. We'll squirt this back inside of here. And then we'll squirt this back inside of here. Also, by the way, if you didn't notice, I got a level. We're up to 82 now while we were doing stuff and things out there, fighting around. All right, Midas, let's go over here to Foulmouth. Oh, baby. Let's go ahead and squirt this on there. Put the kibble in there. Some of this, some of this, some of that. And we have so much kite. We'll just drop that on the ground one day. All right, nailed it. Sweet. So... We've got Foulmouth now. He's kind of slow. He's not super, super great. He's really kind of... You know what's kind of crazy is that Midas is kind of gold-colored, and this guy's almost kind of bronze-colored. It's kind of cool. They're kind of like a pair. It's really interesting coloring. I think it's kind of neat. So um, we're going to head over to the island, but you know what we haven't done this season yet, guys? It's time to get some hot-level action. We've got to get some levels, peeps, and I think it's time to montage it up. Let's go ahead and see if we can't find a really cool song and uh, get some cool level action going here, peeps. Let's do it.
And we're back. Hope you guys liked the montage. Make sure if you did, you smash that thumbs up button, peeps. We got all sorts of hot level action. Yeah, I know. I'm going to talk about that there in a second. 10,000 health now, 1,000 melee damage. Haven't touched any stamina, 152% movement speed. We're at level 266. I got a bunch of items off a couple of alpha raptors you may have seen that I killed in the um, in the uh, montage. I got an apprentice metal pick or apprentice metal sickle right here, which is a super good find. That's like super useful and just some other stuff and things. Oh, yeah, we got a ramshackle uh, metal pick so we can go ahead and chuck this Garbo one out. But, um, yeah, there is an Alpha T-Rex over here, level 15. So, our guy's pretty powerful, but Alpha Rexes are no joke. So, I'm not sure if this is going to work out. Let's go ahead and see if we can't take this guy down. Are you stuck? It would be great if you were stuck right there. Okay, you're not stuck. So, we lost on that front. I'm probably going to have to stop and heal a few times in order to take this guy. Oh, we got him on his tail right now. This is perfect. But we are kind of low on stamina. I didn't really raise my... Or I didn't really recharge my stamina before we started. So this could be bad. I don't know. I got him. He's not even hitting me, though. I'm pretty sure I'm hitting him. I think. Am I hitting you? I'm not getting the noise. Oh, I killed a scorpion. I think we are. This would be perfect if we just, like, kite him in a circle like this. Oh, there we got a couple hits I heard. Okay, one of the big things we don't want to do is get stuck. So we're going to have to change or charge up some stamina, recharge some stamina here. And uh, he's going now. He, now he's peeved off. And while he runs around, if he eats, he's going to recharge HPs, which we don't want. We don't want that. Oh, he's stuck, I think. Oh, my gosh. It would be so perfect if we could get him stuck because he's going to be so much XP. Oh, we got him running around in circles again. This is going to be perfect. Oh, yeah, baby, we did it. Oh, man, two Alpha Raptors and an Alpha T-Rex on this leveling session. That's so unbelievably cool. Apprentice, we got the Rex Alpha Rex trophy. We got, oh, a Journeyman Metal hatchet. The rest of this crap, oh, oh, Mastercraft stone, Mastercraft bow. That's cool. We got a Mastercraft. We'll probably never use it, but we still have it. So that's awesome. So, so very cool. We got a bunch of levels. Let's see if we can't get the movement speed up to 200. Ah, oh, we only got a couple. We level. I leveled this up guy up quite a bit already. 10,000 HPs, 1,000 melee damage. You know, for now, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and get the prime meat off of this guy. Oh, there we go. We got it all. We're going to head back to base, cook up a bunch of this prime meat, heal, lick our wounds a little bit, put some of our eggs away. I got a bunch of eggs as well, guys. I got a Carno egg. Six more RGs, three more scorpions, and two car or two a carno egg and one raptor egg. So, um, all right, sweet. All sorts of cool stuff going on. Let's head back to base, peeps. And we're back. I cooked up all of our prime meat. Put all of our I had some extra meat in there. I scored the extra meat in there. Put all that stuff and things away that we had. And I'm wearing our trophy for our amazing Alpha T-Rex kill. So, super, super cool. I went ahead and put some more prime meat and some more regular meat inside of these guys. And uh, next thing I think we're going to do... Oh, also, I went out... I forgot to tell you. I went out and gathered some stone, and I have it over there crafting up some cementing paste. Because I want to make some more of the water reservoirs. So, over here, I want to go ahead and get more water reservoirs set up. And I want to get a couple of taps set up, too. So, we actually need to learn... Let me see here. I want to put the metal irrigation tap. So, I need to use the metal irrigation pipe straight... So, let's go ahead and learn the metal irrigation pipes, like so, and then that'll let us learn the tap. And I think I can hook the tap up to a, a stone pipe, I think. I just want the metal tap because it looks cool. So, I want to put a bunch more of the um, metal irrigation tanks back here and a couple of taps. And then I want to uh, get, uh, yeah, the, the flooring extended out here and just kind of make it look like a thing. So, I'm going to go ahead and start gathering up some resources so we can do that. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that we've got. Do we have some stuff all ready to go? I don't think I have any pillars. Oh, I do. I have pillars. I have ceilings. That's pretty great right there. We need the cementing paste for us to build the irrigation. I think we have enough metal to do it to go ahead and get that done. So, all right. Um, you know what? I should probably build a couple of thatch foundations too just to make stuff and things look better. So we'll go ahead and do like this. Or thatch ceilings, pardon me. Or thatch roofs. That still hasn't been fixed. So how many can we build of those? Six. That'll be plenty. So I'm going to go ahead and get a little bit more stuff set up over here so that I can't jump it. Crap! So that we can set up the irrigation station. This will be where we get our water from now on. 
And uh, I think it's going to be rad. I'm not sure how many of the irrigation reservoirs or the metal reservoirs that we're going to need. But I think it's going to be enough. I th or enough. I think it's going to be a lot. So let's take a look here. And uh, I'll do some crafting. And I'll be back. Peeps. And we're back. I think I have all the stuff that we need in order to get this done back here. I think it's going to turn out to look really cool. I did some counting of how much, how many of the reservoirs we're going to need and this and that. But I had to tear down the one that I'd already placed because I can't place... I can place the reservoir on the ceiling, but I can't place the ceiling under the reservoir. So we got to go like so. And then now we're going to place one of them there. Actually, we're going to place our taps too. We're going to place our tap like so. And then the other tap's going to go over here like that. And then now these guys can go in here, here, here. Oh, that's kind of weird. Oh, is it going to be weird? That's, that is weird. All right. Oh, crap. Now I'm not going to be able to place the ceilings. Oh, no. I made a huge mistake. Oh, man. All right. We have to go ahead and demolish these two. Like so and like so. Now we have to place our ceilings. We're going to have to build two more. And I don't know if I have the resources to do it. Come here. Come here. Come here. You know you want to place. Sweet. Go here. Here. And here. Now we can place these guys. Let's place them on the inside. See how you can do either one. We'll do the inside of both of these. Is that... There we go. Like that. And then we can do three more, I think. Here. Oh, and then I'm out. So I need to build two more. I think I'm running out of some sort of resource. Let's go ahead back over here and check what we need. I'm not sure exactly what it is. So if we want to build more of these reservoirs, what are we out of? Metal? Crap. Okay. Oh, I have 74 on me from tearing those down. Now can we build at least one? All right, sweet. So we got the one, and then I'm not sure. I think that I'm out of metal now. I'm pretty sure I grabbed all of the rest that we have. So I'm going to have to go get some, and yeah, we're out, I do believe. Do I have any back over here? I just cleaned the smithy out, too. No? Emergency metal? Yes! 18. That's not even close to enough. 61! Oh, baby, I think we just did it. And there should be some more cementing paste, but I think we already have enough. Oh, sweet! So we have exactly the right amount. I have to go get resources again. So let's head over, build our last reservoir, and just take a look. We'll have a step back and see what this all looks like. All right, get in there. Squirt in there. One of these, one of those, one of them. And then this. Oh, yeah! Wait, did you get there? Wait, what the crap? Get in my inventory, silly. Thumbs up for being prepared, kind of. All right, so we'll pop back over here, and then we have two more of these guys to do, and we should be good to go. So now we're going to place one there and there. That's a huge amount of water. Look at it all, man. Hold on. we got to, like, get a flyer out here so we can fly over and see what it looks like. No, not Midas. Sorry, buddy. I love you, but we got to play around with Foulmouth a little bit since we have our new Super RG. So let's go ahead and take a look over here and see what it looks like. That's pretty cool. You know what we should do? We should put some fencing around it or something like that. I think that would look really neat. But that's going to be a huge amount of water. It's like super awesome water supply. I got to tell you what, guys. We got the new Super RG today. We got the new Super Water Supply done. I think that's going to be it, guys. I had a great time hanging out. I hope that you did, too. Thanks so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button and show your support. Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. And may the stuff and things be with you.